Hey, what's up, guys? This is Attack411. This is my full review of some cases from this Tronic for the Samsung Galaxy S5. Here, I do have all of the models of the matte back TPU version of these cases. I'm gonna go through each of these four cases because they all have a bit of a different personality to them. I'm gonna show you which one you might like. So, I'm first gonna start with the regular black model. And this is a really nice case. I've always been a big fan of Stronic cases for any device, whether it be HTC One or iPhone or uh, Nexus 5. I've always liked them for their simplistic design, great build, feel in the hand, affordable price tag, and an overall thin design but still a lot of protection. In this case, it's exactly that. It's made of a very soft, matte rubber material that really feels great in the hand. It's smooth, it doesn't really get scratches or fingerprints. It might get some oils, but it feels really great in the hand. It's probably the best feeling case you can get. On the front, you do have the rubber to give you shock absorption, some extra grip, and a lay on the table design, of course, so when you face it down, your screen will be protected. But luckily, this case still does allow you to have a screen protector on, and overall, it feels great, it looks great, it gives you complete access to every single port needed on this device. It still is very easy to take on and off, and once it's on, it's pretty snug, and overall, this is an excellent case. Now the blue version of this case is pretty much the same as the black version. It's got the really smooth texture on the back that feels great in the hand. It's got the same great cutouts and openings for all the buttons and ports. The only difference being of course that is blue. But this also isn't the opaque look that the black version of this case has. It's kind of a frosted or blurry look that looks really cool. And honestly, this is my favorite of the four cases, the blue version. It could be for a guy or a girl, it still gives you complete access to everything, and it still feels great in the hand. Now taking a look at the pink glitter flex, and you can see this is a lot different of a case. You see on the back, instead of that really smooth rubber type TPU matte feeling, this is more of a glossy but extremely grippy material that will get some smudges and fingerprints and reflection. But like I said, it will give you a lot more grip, and it feels a little bit more sticky and kind of tacky in the hand. It won't give you the same smooth feeling, but it'll give you some more protection because of that tackiness. It's just as easy to put on and off, and when you have it on, you can see it still gives you access to all of the ports. But the only design difference being that the back is slightly more see-through than the others, and also that it has the kind of pink glittery or glitter flex look to it. That if you're a girl, I think it would be a pretty cool look. As a guy, you know, pink isn't really for me, and it's really a kind of bright, vibrant, hot pink color. But like I said, this is a good case for a girl, and it works just as well as the other cases, so I do like it in the fact that it is a nice case. And last but not least, we do have the white, or it's actually kind of a milk color. And this is pretty much the same as the pink, except it is pretty much completely clear. Now it does have a slight kind of frosted or milky uh, glow to it, but it pretty much is 100% translucent or transparent. As you can see, the Samsung logo, it's got a tiny, tiny bit of a... Uh, a fuzzy look to it, but like I said, it's almost 100% see-through. And this has got the same stickiness of the pink case, so it'll give you a lot of grip and a lot of protection. But it's got the same thinness, the same open cutouts, and the same great overall design and protection of all four cases. So these are really probably one of my favorite cases for the Galaxy S5. I haven't had any faults with them, they feel nice, they provide a lot of protection, they're affordable. And they look really nice. So if you really can't go wrong, if you're a guy, you can pick from any of these. I wouldn't really recommend the pink, obviously. But they're still a great option. You can check the link in the description if you would like to buy this. And I'll see all of you guys later.